Hi guys! So it's a different location right now because I'm at my grandma's place. And yeah, you can hear like roosters. I know, right? Um, but I'm not at home. And actually, I just want to let you guys know that I got a new body. I got a new body last month. Just because if you all didn't know, I broke my camera, which is my 600D. So I got the Canon EOS 80D. All right, you guys, so this is the 80D. And um, I really like that the back here is touch screen and the quality, basically just the quality of this video is really great. And I actually took some footage um, at our crusade last week. So as you guys can see here, this is the quality of the video. Video, and I think that my camera doesn't even do justice with it. I'm basically taking behind the scenes footage of every single thing that was happening, you know, before the crusade and everything. So that's just about it. And I like that I can just swipe it just like this. I'm also filming with the 50mm lens here because I find that all of the night shots are just really great um, when you use 50mm. So yep, that's just about it. I really, really like um, the quality of this, even on low light, you know, because it's great because you can adjust the, um, the ISO. So it's always awesome. I have to adjust the setting of this camera to my video editor just because I'm using um, a Sony Vegas 10 Pro right now. And um, the thing also that I like about this is that it has 60 frames per second and it takes 1080p in HD. So yeah, I can finally um, amp up my video into 1080 HD, but I will have to configure that format on YouTube just because for some reason YouTube last time won't let me upload in 1080p. So I'm pretty much happy with the quality of the ATD. So yep, this is what my new body looks like. So you guys, I just filmed two videos and actually just realized that my grandma's place, as I've said, there's just a lot of cool spots and places here to where I can situate this camera and the angle is just amazing. The lighting is also great because there's a huge like window here, like a sliding window. So I get all the light. I grew up here, <laughs> so, but I changed, we actually changed location now, but yeah, I pretty much remember this place, you know, growing up, and a lot has changed, but yeah, it always be in our hearts. <laughs> and also, by the way, you guys, um, later in the afternoon, I'm planning to go to the shrine. Usually, it's tradition every... First of January, my cousins, usually we would go to the shrine. So I'm gonna take you all there to see the whole situation of the shrine. And also, if my cousins are watching this, you guys, I can show you the throwback of our childhood here. This is like a legit antique. It was there way before when I was born. <laughs> so let me show you guys a cool spot right here. This is actually a great place to take OOTDs. <laughs> Just because of the cool grass there and everything, but I think I need to wait for the sun to go down so that the lighting is gonna be like really mild and cool. This is my grandma and my grandpa. They actually have a lot of antique paintings here, which I thought was pretty cool. Amazing. Jesus said, I will never turn away anyone who comes to me. Amen. They actually have dogs here too. Blessing! Come here! Oh no, she doesn't like me. Hi, Blessing. I'm a dog person. I'm not gonna harm you. I don't know what your name is, but hi. This is our local ridge back here in the Philippines. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. But I really I really couldn't find the breed here. Like, But he kind of looks-ish like one. <laughs> I'm kidding. You look like a ridge back. Say yes. No, okay. Okay. Hi, little one. You don't want to be filmed? Okay, you don't want to be filmed. All right, bye. I'll leave you alone. That house, oh my gosh. It has been there ever since when I was a little girl. And this is like a typical Filipino thing. There's always like a basketball place on some random areas. <laughs> so yeah. 
All right, so right here you can see the mountains. Here we go, overview of the mountain. So Tita Ann, are you ready? Let's play ball. <laughs> Let's play basketball. <laughs> It says here that this monument was erected to the memory of the Filipinos. Why is it spelled like that? <laughs> um, the Japanese soldiers and civilians who sacrificed their lives in Negros Island during the World War II. We cordially pray that their spirits will be consoled and everlasting peace and prosperity may reign all over the world. October 18, 1980. Oh my god. Yeah. There's like people buried here. <laughs> Mm -mm. Okay. I would remember that this is a place to where we usually would sit and take pictures. And that's the sword right there. This one. I don't know if you can put it on that. Kalachuchi. Kalachuchi. I remember my brother would actually, and TJ, my cousin, would hop in from here. To there. That is the accomplishment of their lives when they can go from here to there. Also that we took a picture right here and then here's the overview once again it's the mountains you can't really see it but the mountains is somewhere there. <laughs> Goodbye shrine. Bye. Because I'm the only cousin here so that's awkward. All right that's it. We also used to photo shoot on the stairs right there. So pretty. <laughs> I think they're cute and cool. Those are so cute. Guys, I didn't even know that we have a neem tree here. I know there's such a thing as a neem oil. Yeah, this is great for dandruff. How do you use it, Tita? Like, do you get the petals? You get the leaves? Leaves. Ah, and then you boil the leaves. Ah, okay, wow, okay. This place is really meant to like take pictures with. Really nice, cool pictures with. I wish my cousin was here to take picture in here. Yeah. It's so cool, yay! Look at those dogs. Good morning, little ones. Hi.